Hi, today I'm going to be talking to you about a brand new product, the EMU hardware. Now we've been working on this for a long time already and finally we've got everything ready and we think this is a great addition to the EMU software. Let me go through some of the features. We have a 5-pin DMX port so you can go directly to your 5-pin DMX lights. We have a 3-pin DMX port so you can go to 3-pin DMX light if you're using 3-pin cable. We have an Ethernet port, RJ45. I'll get to that in a second. We have a TRS port for a foot switch or MIDI. We have a cool RGB logo. Who doesn't love RGB? And we have a USB-C, keeping up with all the latest USB-C standards. Why have we got an RJ45 on the EMU hardware? Most computers now don't have RJ45 ports anymore. Everything works through USB-C. A lot of our products have RJ45 ports. We're talking our ODEs, Octos, Pixelated Minis, and we've got other products coming too. What we wanted to do was to make the life easy for everyone who uses the EMU hardware. Mostly, they don't have time to be fussing around with all these connectors and adapters. So what we did, we made a special RJ45 port that when connected to our products, will auto configure those products inside the EMU software. So from a user point of view, all you need to do is grab your, for example, OD Mark III, plug it into the EMU hardware RJ45 port and EMU will auto detect it and let you auto configure it directly from EMU. That's amazing, I'm really happy. Let me connect the EMU hardware and show you exactly how it works. I've got a small lighting rig behind me. Typical kind of lighting rig you find in a small bar, a band, something like this. So here I've got my two cables that go back to my rig. I've got a five pin DMX XLR that goes to the moving heads. And I've also got the RJ45 on an Ethercon that goes back to my Octo. Actually, the Octo right on the table here is sitting here. So let me grab my EMU hardware. I'm gonna connect IRJ45. I'm going to connect my five pin DMX, USB-C with the included cable. We supply high quality cables. And I'm gonna plug this in to my computer. Once it's plugged in, I'm going to start EMU. Now, when EMU start, it's going to automatically detect the EMU hardware. Not only that, if there's any other device connected to the RJ45, it's going to automatically detect those also. Now, you might have seen behind me the, start, the light started to move. That's EMU that's just booted up on my computer, found the hardware, and is actually running the show that I had programmed before. And that's a wrap on our intro in the new EMU hardware. Stay tuned for more in-depth tutorials about EMU. Until then, admire this cool RGB logo.